Louisa Sophie Willoway is the U.S. Right, Rocky Abebe Alt, and there is the Hungarian Dominika Gardi. Sounds as if there's a, a little Italian in the background there, Gardi. And of course, the Italians have a fantastic tradition line speed skating as well right here we go then this is the women's point elimination 10,000 meters final right at the end of this race we will see the top three the gold silver and bronze positions and who's going to take up the lead they will take it in turns of course 49 laps you can see over the top that's the first 200 complete. In fact, now they're on lap 48. And when you hear the bell, the skater at the back will be eliminated. There will be point scoring as well. Each, each skater, well, they're in line at the moment and in the slipstream, leading the way right at this moment. Looks like it could be uh, Sturi Raj. Forty-two, the forty-second lap, there'll be points scored there. And uh, Rati Kasturi Raj has done her bit. Taking over the lead now with a lovely little rhythm, leading the train. Hungarian Gardi. On the third last lap. It's a long way, but uh, you can see that the choo choo train up comes on the outside. You can see now a, a change. There's a little bit of movement forward, and it's Chinese Taipei's Yang Yong Chi that adds a little bit of momentum into the action. She says, Come on, let's get a little bit going. The speed. May just see a breakaway in a while, but for the moment they're content to hang in there two laps until we get uh, the first bit of real action. Very similar styles, they're not leaning forward too much, but in great balance, good control. It is uh, 54. That is uh, Yang Yong Chi leading the way, and now you can see a little bit of movement. And w who's going to be the first to be dropped off? And it's uh, Panic Stations at the back. There's the Colombian Mondragon coming up on the outside, overtaking uh, Yang Yong Chi, and they're working hard for the first points. Now they will back off a little bit, but uh, there was definitely a bit of a spurt there. We saw some very interesting difference in speed uptake there. Taking a look around is Mondragon, and then being overtaken. Are we going to see a big break? Ah, well, that's. Certainly someone off the back there, Mondragon from Quintero Vale of uh, Venezuela. They're both together there, the Venezuelan at the front, Quintero Valero, Angie Annabella. Fabulous name, isn't it? On the inside again, we get the Chinese Taipei, Yang Yong Chi comes forward once again. Three points there for Mondrag, Mondragon and Quintero. So this is a very, very interesting start. Argentina 
coming forward again now, and that's Rocio Berba out. 37 laps to go. The points you will find. Hey, I told you they would rest on their legs at their knees just a little bit from time to time. Tactically, they're looking around. Here comes Mondragon again. On the outside, Berber Alt. There was a warning there for Dominica Gardi. And Berber Alt has picked up a couple of points there. Quintero takes the lead at four points. Two and one point. Uh, delivered. And then another couple of points there. Delivered to Chile. And a very, very impressive performance there by the Chilean girl. That's uh, Translavina Lopez. So it's very much a South American flavor at the minute. Look at that Colombia, Venezuela, Argentina, and Chile. But still, we see Young Young Chi now making a big effort. Oh, and it's Colombia. Oh, she is so naughty, isn't she? The Colombian Mondragon coming up to steal a, a march there, but Yang does pick up a point. Mondragon knew that she could pick up two and go into the lead. That's exactly what happened. She's so aware. Great experience over the years, and it showed perfectly there. 32 laps. And now, some great inline movement right here. This is uh, Angie Annabella Quintero Valera again from Chile, uh, from Venezuela, I beg your pardon. Venezuela, I'm picking up another point, and there's one dropped off the back there. Young, still with that single point. One dragon of Colombia, just pushing out into the lead again. And there. Got uh, Gabriela Vargas Sarmiento of Ecuador trying hard, but uh, it looks like the American, the US, has gone from the field. Rene Rogers has been eliminated. Again, it's still it's South America and a little smidgen of Asia there with the Chinese Taipei in sixth place. At the moment, equal fourth is uh, Berber Alt from Slavina. Okay, it's all about tactics at the moment. 54 there again is Yang Yung Chi. She deserves to pick up an another few points, doesn't she? Eliminations continuing. And you can see there with 25 laps to go, 4.8 kilometers complete. Seven, well, nearly eight minutes gone. Mondragon has continued with a fantastic performance. Mondragon of Colombia, eight points at the moment. She's so aware of when to put the pressure on. There she comes up on the outside again. She's on the left of picture as we look now. It's, uh, it's time for the rest of the pack to start putting in some big efforts here. They want to get back on into a position of challenge. Once again, we've got the. There she goes. Once again, Mondragon comes up on the inside. We're past halfway, a long way past halfway now, and the, the legs are beginning to really, really suffer. Hands on knees. On Dragon is right there once again, picking up the points. No danger of getting uh, eliminated here. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, but left in the pack at the moment. On Dragon has picked up another couple. There you go, ten points. Quintero is back to five, leveled up with Vargas. Just one point back from that, the French girl, Lefeuve now, she's in the, the all blue, has uh, put in a big, big effort and picked up, she's 
now been dropped out of the pace again, but uh, she's equal third, fourth place at the moment. We're going to see another big effort from the Colombian. But, uh, it looks like at the moment it's uh, Ale Ale uh, Alessandra Andrea Translavina from Chile who is going to close the gap on Mondragon. Working hard, there's three of them now gone for it. Mondragon, will they be pulled back in? But it's now the time to make a break, perhaps. Three leaders at the moment working hard, but they're getting dragged back in, back into the peloton. Four leaders now. And Dragon is the, at the rear of those leading, the leading pack of four. Slavina gets a good position there with 16 laps remaining and putting pressure on. Dragon still with a great lead in the points. Desi coming around on the outside now. Going to try to pick up another couple. There you pick him up. Mondragon takes 12. Slavina from Chile is at six overall. I have to say Mondragon. She just is in so much control. She's pumping again, looking to make a break. Looking around to see who's uh, attacking. The fervor is still on four points at the moment. Who's going to get dropped off? It's only 12 left in this competition at the moment. Vargas Samient from Ecuador has moved up to five, equal third. And again, there she is, leading that uh, little group there, Translavina from Chile. Now, Berber Alt is putting in a big effort here now as well. Berber Alt. Argentina working those arms a little bit harder than she has recently but uh, she's picked up another couple of points and that's a very very good four points picking up the pace here now this is a break attempt Argentina together with Yang Yongqi of Chinese Taipei can she get back up into the points? Ah, they can't, uh, they can't squeeze out Mondragon. She's right there on the heels. Mondragon again is going to pick up another couple. There you go, 15 points for Mondragon. Eight to Translavina. And five to Quintero and Vargas. They are feeling the pace at the moment with nine laps remaining. Mondragon, the Colombian is in great shape. She's been in control throughout this points elimination and uh, continues to be outsmarting the rest of the field. Here's another big drive. Coming on Dragon in the lead at 15 points. Translavina with eight. Who's going to now make this one happen? Warning, number 31. And uh, 31 has been... Uh, Pushed out, that's Geyser from Germany. Time for a little break. Wow. Who's going to take over the responsibilities at the front? Taking the wind on as well. Here's another big drive. Round the outside, but another great control from Mondragon. Watching what's going on, she's got 17 points. Translavina at eight. This is another. Big, big attempt coming up into great shape is Alejandra Translavina. And those three, Translavina, Mondragon and Vargas, look very, very well set. The 
There's another push with five laps to go. It's getting serious now, really serious. Nine kilometers done. We've got uh, one kilometer left. Watch for the speedsters here. Once again, Mondragon has done a brilliant job, but she's not actually completed the work at the moment. 18 to 8. Once again, three laps to go, and there's a lot of pumping going on right here. That looks... Actually, Geyser is still there. Geyser for Germany is still there. I thought she'd been dropped off, but she's now come into contention. Four points on the this. She's in sixth place overall, leading the pack round at the moment. And who's going to overtake and take it up? It's Mondragon again, of course. And there... Another big, big drive to come through with just one lap remaining. One dragon. And there it's uh, Marine Claire Rene Lefebvre who is coming up to actually take the bell. One lap to go. And one lap to go. But the points scoring with one dragon out at 19 is absolutely in top position but here's the french girl coming once a french woman should i say there she crosses the line and the finish in 16 minutes 12.80 seconds but mondragon absolutely superb points finish there lefervre left it very late to get up into second place overall for france but wow what a finish that was the last three laps she put together and the Colombians will be celebrating again another magnificent uh, victory number 15, take uh, out. Let's bring the, noise. the women's Colombian team are absolutely in ecstasy so there the winner of this points elimination competition Joanna Viveros Mondragon she has got such a great pedigree they all knew she was the danger and uh, well we know after winning gold at the 2017 world games that was in the 20 kilometer elimination race the colombian teams there can celebrate the supporters absolutely thrilled delighted the newspapers in colombia in Cali, where she comes from, will be absolutely thrilled. Front page, photographs, another huge, huge victory for Colombian team. Wonderful to see. She was never in any danger, was she?